Now this is how to create a plasma drone new from cardboard. A perfectly functional plasma drone with the two electrodes connected at the junction and the junction connected to a step up transformer designed at home. I intend to step up the 3.5 volts I have in this battery to over a thousand volts using the step up transformer and we both know MOSFETs don't grow near rivers they grow in warm places so I can't just walk along the river and find a MOSFET growing so I actually have to DIY my own electric switch that turns the current on and off for about a hundred times a frequency of a hundred times per second that would give me the 50 hertz I require to generate the current the current needed to make create a dielectric break now right over here I designed a cross section of the propulsor to show how it works You can see one of the electrodes, the other sharp pointed electrodes, this other electrode made out of aluminium foil. You know what this does. I split the electrode to increase surface area for ripping off of electrons from free air to create a stronger jet at this point. Now as you can see a strong jet leaving from this point creates a negative pressure at this area causing the fluid from this point to move in through the slit opening into the system increasing, increasing the release of pressure at this point that's called Wanda effect the propulsor also narrows towards the bottom to allow Bernoulli's principle to kick in eventually we have a very strong jet of hair leaving the propulsor at the bottom creating the thrust yeah that's where Newton's third law of motion kicks in action reaction equal and opposite well apart from the sound of the living jet of hair and probably that of the switch I'm thinking of DIYing from solenoid engines there is virtually no sound produced by this so this is the sneakiest drone on earth the most quiet drone on earth this drone is actually going to be so silent in a creepy way that's why I named it till death because quiet and creepy things are like from horror movies <laughs> I know this would look a lot better if it was 3d printed but we both know 3d printers don't grow along rivers either they grow in warm places <laughs> They are not part of the river and vegetation. Now, unlike quantum physics, this is very cool and understandable. Actually, quantum physics is a lot more understandable than this. I think it's child's play. Things about quantum chromodynamics, quantum field theory, that's the first quantum field theory being quantum electrodynamics, quantum chromodynamics with the quarks and antiquarks and baryons and mesons and stuff mesons being a quark and an anti-quark combining and instantly annihilating that's crazy why would they even combine in the first place if they are thinking of annihilating each other and three quarks combining exchanging gluons to form the baryons that makes a lot of sense changing color becoming neutral becoming neutral white that's actually sensible well i think quantum physics is just human beings trying to cover up things they still do not understand about the universe at large <laughs> pretty funny human beings don't like not understanding things okay quantum physics i said i think combining Ionic thrusters with quanta effect and Bernoulli's principle could give us the dream flying car.
we finally fulfilled our flying car dream otherwise please like and subscribe and check out my other videos